Now then, one thing that really gets my goat is the amount of people trying to jump on a bandwagon and put down the greatest living Englishman, Paul McCartney. Yes, I won't have it. OK, so the performance at the Olympics, preceded by the Queen's Jubilee, may not have been what it might have been 20 years ago, but he's still the greatest living singer. So I say to the doubters, get off his back. Get off his back and get back to where you belong, which is in the sin bin for your doubters, because I'm not having it. Paul McCartney, part of the Lennon-McCartney singer-songwriting partnership, and, of course, member of the Beatles, one of the greatest iconic people of the last half of the 20th century and the first half of the 21st. Do you know what this man did for the world? He changed the world. So I say to all you doubters, let it be, let it be, let it be, let it be. If you don't, you will answer to me because i'm one of paul mccartney's biggest fans Lennon mccartney they changed the world okay they literally brought down the berlin wall because if they hadn't started the cultural revolution rock and roll in the mid-60s the communism might have gone on forever and all those people will still be entrapped and enslaved okay so my message to paul to mccartney one of the greatest living englishmen and the man who deserves immense respect is this okay hey paul don't be dismayed, you have got there and you will stay there The minute they start to get under your skin Then you'll begin to make it better, 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 better Was that hitting the high notes high enough? Paul McCartney, one of the greatest living Englishmen, you stop giving him stick, otherwise you'll be hearing from me, the Porkmeister. Got it?